Welcome to my Let's Play series of Horizon Forbidden West. If you like the video, please consider subscribing for more. I don't know if I can actually get in this way. are shut. I guess I'll have to come back later. Answers that question. Who's with us? Let her pass. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within. The cool route should be starting soon. Once it's done... I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaro's throne. And Ether. Are you the only one listening to these voices? Oh, no. The others who captured the Osiram Delver heard the voices from these ancient warriors, too. They spread the word, and now a lot of people are talking about them. <laughs> Soldiers are interested in old battles. I have more voices for you to preserve. You honor the fallen. Thank you. I will make sure the story of these soldiers is told again. What will you do with the recordings? Well, I'll have to speak to my superiors and see if we can make space for them. They aren't from the Ten, but the voices of all warriors must be heard and remembered. I'll let you know if I find more voices. Outlander, the chief awaits you in the arena, past the throne. This must lead to the arena.
That's another part of the ruins. Turned into a fighting ring. If they can't face these machines, let every blade win honor. Will you stand alongside us? Here, the ten stood firm. Let those rebels try it's to stop. We must be united under one leader, Pakaro. me while I steal your shit. Hmm. This could be useful. And that minus 23 on electricity is Terrible. Aloy, it seems you've had to move mountains to bring the Sky Clan to heal. Literally. Catalo helped. Yes. Takote reprimanded for all the clan to see. You both served well. But now the cool route is at hand. Some have come to compete, others to bear witness. They know Regala will come for me. I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end, as long as you remember yours. So what's the plan? Catalo. There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool route with machines, she will have to attack by the trail. You will join our defenders there. Hold the line, and I'll have my marshals. You will be free of my service and receive your reward. Make whatever preparations you must. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. The grove, the arena, it's all part of the same ancient structure? Yes. Here the land remembers the sacrifice of the Ten. Their deeds commemorated for eternity. Sacrifice? The visions tell us that on the ground below, they gave their lives in a fight against machines. We honored them by holding the cool route where they fell. I know where I'll be. What about you two? I will be here with the Chief, where I belong. Should the fight reach us, we will take the blood owed for our fallen. If it comes to that, the defenses will hold. Let's get this over with. Good. You'll find Decca at the north barricade with the rest of our defenders. Strike true as the ten. I'll see you when this is done. We'll assist Marshal Catalo with guarding the chief. No lowlander. The desert contestants look more flamboyant. I've got some shot. This is a ceremony, not entertainment. This will be a heavy day. We must stand firm. With your fate amongst us, we will defeat. Do you have ceremonies like this? In This cool road will honor the fallen marshals and ordain new. Watch you. 
Easterner. Didn't think the Sky Commander himself would be joining us today. If there's a chance my challengers will be facing Regala, it is only right their commander join in their fate. Or maybe you need to save face after what happened at the bulwark. Careful now. Sometimes sharp wits bring out sharp spears. I'd save my spear for Regala's troops if I were you. Carl's defenders should be at the end of the stretch. But we must hold. And look, we are not alone in this fight. Focus on the machines. Take them down, and Regala's forces become no different from our own. Yes, Chaplain. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed. Our soldiers are ready. They will defend the cool route from below, but from above. Not bad. Where did you get it? One of our squads ripped it off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our teeth. Cool root is upon us. Our struggle demands new blood, new leaders. Release the quarry. Challenger, approach. Take down a machine shall be named Marshall. Remember the ten. Strike from the air as they did and seize your glory. Let 
Damn. Wasn't quite what I thought it would be. There can't be all of them. Sure, I wasted too much ammo doing there. that. What is that? Snakey. I don't know. Snakey boy. Hold the defenses. Go. You all gonna die. Shots from that ballista. Oh! 
Come on. Come on. Doesn't seem to build up on him at all. That was harder than the first time you had to fight.
Regala went after Hikaru and Katalo. I gotta get to them. Make sure I collect all the loot I can because I need more bed okay, and then. shit. Really? You're gonna stop a bat with a rope? Finished. I'll be back with everything I have. And all who stand with Hakaro will be run red. At attention. You fought well. Proved yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. You're the only one still left alive, so you're marshals. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. I failed. I should have finished with Ala. But now she'll be back with more machines. Stronger than ever. I'll do what I can to help. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called for. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then. But I believe in you now. So leave me. And get to your task. What will you do? Tend to the wounds. What you need is there. Take it. Your deeds today will be remembered like those of the ten.
There. That console. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Aether subordinate function to original code. Got it. Now to get this back to Gaia. in the grove have changed the words of the ten are now clear to us here this must be the vision that chief Ikaro saw years ago the visions throughout the grove are different now and this one it, it just appeared is this your doing visions have changed the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines. Scarcity of food and water. Storms that drive us from our homes. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. Leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction that when we are united, we can overcome any threat. Join me. Join us in that conviction as we strive for a nation and a world without want or war. Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. I don't need a dude with just one arm. I will stand with you on your mission. I'm not starting a Def Leppard cover band. If whatever is left of my life, it is what I choose. Can I say no to that? By saying no? So, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. Will do, Aloy. Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours? 
Should be interesting. Alright, I need to get Aether back to Gaia. Seems like capturing it did something to the other holograms, too. Might be worth checking out. Regala's threats were empty. The cool routes can begin. Discover how JTF-10 claimed home field advantage in the desert. <gasps> JTF-10 seized key assets all across the desert. Where others feared the Mojave's raging sandstorms, JTF soldiers used them for cover, Your enemy. crippling oh. enemy supply lines. Out in the field, a relaxing at base, Joint Task Force 10 acted as one. Led by Colonel Edward De La Hoya, their bodies and weapons were always honed for battle. Meals, ink, bruises. These daredevils of the Eloy. sky shared it all. Do you have a moment? Blood of the Ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. We'll just have to remember them then. <laughs> well, thanks to you, the chief still lives. And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, Kavo. He was not counted among the dead. Which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task. So my blade is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. A cavo is the last of my blood. What made Cavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Karja. During the Red Raids, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Karja all the way to Meridian. So when Regala attacked the embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. And for Kavo, it was probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop it. You said Kavo is your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans warred constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. One by one, I buried my children. And then, their children. I'm sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. 
And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. So if Cavo didn't listen to you when he joined the rebels, what makes you think he will now? Cabo was too young to fight during the Red Raids. Moore was a stranger to him. But he must have experienced the suffering it brings by now. He will listen. He must. I just have to find him before it's too late. If Cabo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. The rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. But you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cavo's squad went. Shall we head out? I have some other things to take care of first. I can meet you there. I'll wait for you on the hill crest southeast of the grove. We'll make our way to the outpost from there. Until then, strike true. Champion, I fear we must lean on your strength and generosity again. Just tell it to her straight, Deco. The tribe needs the arena. She's our only hope to getting it open again. You need the arena? But the cool route's over. That's true, but we also use the arena to boost the tribe's morale. We use it for training. Herd in machines so our soldiers can experience the glory of the kill in a controlled setting. Which, of course, boosts morale, but... Chief Hikaru won't let us reopen the arena until the ballista protecting the field is repaired. We need it in case a machine runs amok, and it was damaged during the cool route. The parts we need aren't easy to find. I get it. You need me to hunt down some machines and grab the parts. We ask someone hunting. else, but every squad in the grove is on alert. But the task is not without compensation, right, Kala? Of course. Once the arena is open again, I would be honored to invite you to compete. A wide variety of machines will be available. And I will award you prizes for victory. Not just from the arena, but also for medals won at hunting grounds. You'll be able to trade them for some of the tribe's very best gear. To fix the ballista, we'll need a sinew from a roller bag, along with some bristleback tusks. Both kinds of machines have been spotted near a campfire to the southeast. When you're done, bring the parts to me at the maw of the arena, on the northeast side of the grove. Okay, I'll see what I can do. One more thing, if you're going back into the wilds, I have another duty tied to our soldier's morale. A regrettable one. Every Tanakh soldier carries a tag carved with their squad symbol. Rebels have been hoarding the tags of the soldiers they kill. You might find such tags at any enemy outpost. If you do, bring them to me. I'll make sure they're returned to the soldier squad mates and loved ones. Having confirmation sometimes soothes their grief. And there are bounties involved, if that matters to you. I've already found some of those tags. I don't have anything to pay you with here. Bring them to me at the Maw of the Arena when you can. Thank you, Champion. And please don't forget the parts for the Ballista. All of that wrapped up. This Guess seems like a good place to end the episode. I already have enough bristleback tusks on me. Uh, thanks for watching.